David, tell us why you decided to do another open house. We've been doing, as you well know, you're one of our regular visitors. Um, we've been doing a Christmas open house for quite a few years now. It, it fits in very well with the whole Herco year. We have a national sales meeting and then we invite all our customers over for a little bit of lunch and also to see all, really the full range. And also what's great is we get um, up to 20 good suppliers, all the people we work closely with, and the customers get a chance to see what, see all the options that are offered, see the latest technology, and then have a chat about their next requirements in a relaxed atmosphere. It's been a great year. I mean, I, I think there's, it's been challenging. Um, there have been peaks and troughs, but what's good is it's a proper show year. So we had Southern Manufacturing at the start of the year, very well attended. Mac was very good for us. Um, great chance to see a lot of customers and then we've, we had a, a quick demo deals day and then this finally. So the numbers look pretty good for Herco this year but the outlook for next year is, is looking really strong. Yeah we, we have a very what we call a high strike rate if you like. If people come here stand in front of the machines they're not just looking at the control it's not all about conversational programming. The machines stand alone, the performance is very good, we cut metal. We always cut metal at all our shows and we'll stand alongside any, any of the big boys, any of the high performance boys. Um, but yes, you know, standing in, looking at Herco machine, understanding how you'd make the part, understanding the knowledge that's here, the knowledge base, the applications guys, the service guys. You know, we've got a lot of very experienced, knowledgeable people and I think it's understanding the full Herco package and you can really only do that by coming and seeing us and meeting us, watching the machines run. manufacture body of white components, trim and final components for uh, a range of different customers in the automotive sector, um, BMW, JLR, uh, Toyota, Nissan, a few companies. Um, so we've got a few of the Herco machines already, um, they've been brilliant so far, we're looking to try and sort of get more into the five axis, gives a bit more flexibility in what we do. All the guys have been great, really helpful, good to see what's on offer and you know, what the different options are and helping us decide where we want to go now and how we want to gain that five axis. So my name is Brad, I'm one of the sales engineers for Dorma Pramit. Uh, we're a cutting tool manufacturer and we're here supporting Herco today at their open house. So we're looking at forging relationships with the Herco customers. Um, with a lot of the machinery that they sell, we do supply tooling vouchers to help customers get up and running on their machines uh, from the get-go. Yeah, it's been good so far, a lot of footfall through, so looking to keep it going over the next two days. Um, my name is Marcus Hamlin, I'm the sales director of Teamwork Holding. Um, we manufacture, we're the largest manufacturer of jewels in the UK. Uh, we're here to support Herco, um, we work partner with them, um, so we've got some, some products on machines showing uh, what, what we can offer from HWR to Airvice. It's been a good day, yes, it's, a, it's, it's been a great opportunity to, to meet with our partners and, and to meet with the, with the, with the sales team to, to show what we can offer and help them to optimise their solutions for their customers. Yes, so my name is Derek Riley. I'm Chief Technical Officer in University College Dublin. So we're coming here today just to have a look at various different machines that offer, so we're deciding at the moment whether we're going to go for a three-axis machine or a five-axis machine. It's been a great day so far, seeing existing customers, understanding what their challenges are, talk to them about what solutions we can offer and, and, and also seeing people face to face rather than doing it over Teams and over a phone call. That's great, thank you.